This morning on the plaza, we are launching our initiative up with her and I want you to see all the people behind me who are up for Samantha Glenn this morning. She is working to start her own brewery and cafe and we are talking about her journey and how she's making a big splash in an industry that is dominated by men. Samantha Glenn's days are a grind. We caught up with the biomedical engineer prepping for her day job. But I'm riding with her to work to learn about her dream job. Run me through a day, like start to finish. Uh, I usually work at least eight to five. And then I get back to work on the brewery. And I work on the brewery uh, sometimes until 1, 2 a.m. Until I get up the next morning and, and do it again. Sam's real life marathon began as a vacation inspired fantasy to open a brew pub with friends. I'd never brewed a beer before. One of them had brewed a beer before and that was it. So she sought out people who knew how. So I basically just showed up and drank beer and said, okay, what are you doing now? <laughs> Countless beers and conversations later, <laughs> Sam has less time for drinking, instead brewing her own award-winning beer. And she got help from a special group. And you guys Sam's taking me to meet members of the Pink Boot Society. Noble Ray makes a good one, sex in a canoe. <laughs> Cheers. 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 This organization unites women in the beer industry. I've gone to a lot of my meetings as well in, in heels and skirts, and sometimes it's time to put on the boots and get dirty. And that's just what we did on this collaboration brew day at Flix Brew House. It says pump. Uh-huh, idle. Idle, Press it. yeah, push idle. Thank you. Uh -huh. Active. Oh. It's a process. I just, I just brew beer. <laughs> no. And anything that you want to do well, you can always learn. This is hops. Now that smells more like what I think about beer. Okay. <laughs> a place for education. We pronounce it Viet. You did it. High five. Woo! Celebration. Also picking up a bit more banana. And support. And a lot of businesses and breweries open as a husband and wife team, but the wife's doing all the work behind the scenes. So I get the assumption a lot, you and your husband are opening a brewery. No, no, I'm single. Um. Overcoming stereotypes and roadblocks made Sam better at her day job and qualified to teach other women a little something about navigating our hopes and dreams. It is. We just started construction. Sam's dreams are just taking off at the future site of her brew pub. It's always a learning process. She's still mastering a life balance, learning when to push ahead. So there's still a lot of work to do. And when to back off. Last night, I, I took a little bit more time to myself. Like a good cry. Um, <laughs> that was on Monday. <laughs> Okay, so I can't thank Samantha, partners who are out here today, Pink Boots, for letting me infiltrate their lives the past few months. I want to ask for thinking, you know, whatever that may be, what would your advice be? Get involved in the industry, whatever industry that is. Um, research, research, research. So whether that's blogs, podcasts, books, uh, just getting some hands-on experience. Just get out there. Tell yourself you know nothing and just learn as much as you can. Be very humble. Do whatever you can to learn everything. And one of those things I thought was interesting, you're actually taking extra jobs in addition to opening the brewery and being a biochemical engineer, like working behind a waitress. Why is that? Uh, I, I'm going to manage once we open, and I think the best way to manage my people is by knowing their job. So being a bartender, working behind the scenes in the kitchen, cleaning bathrooms, um, prepping, washing dishes, I'll do it all. Uh, my people are going to do it all. Okay, so here's what we want to tell you. Tonight there is a meetup at the future site of Punky Punky. Funky Picnic Brewing Cafe. I've only had coffee, <laughs> let me just tell you that, okay? Right? Okay, I got I got. Here. And we want you to come out here, meet Samantha, hear more from her as we continue to franchise this series up with her. And we've got all the details on your screen. You can also go to the app and meet up and check us out. We are under up with her. I can't thank you enough because. Ball. Let's give a big cheer for Funky Picnic in the brewing industry. We'll be back. Daybreak.